Hello everyone, Clover here, and welcome back to Dark Souls. Oh, it's been a hot minute since I've been able to record. Okay, we're going to try to make this as quick as possible. Today we're going to be going down to the catacombs, so it's going to be a tough one. And uh, I said we're going to the catacombs, but we're going to have to head down real quick to that blacksmith over at the New Launder Ruins. Okay, now that we are down here, let's talk to this guy. I want to purchase item. Or is it modify equipment? No. Okay, well, I'm just out of everything, aren't I? Yeah, I think I'm just out of everything. Okay. That, that's a that's a blunder. Do I have any more homeward bones? Wouldn't be surprised. Yeah, I'm out. Okay. So I'm just gonna cut back. Yeah, I'm gonna cut back to the bonfire. Cause turns out we're gonna just do this the hard way. Now, this is a very important question, because I don't remember if Frampt actually stays since we... Yeah, he's gone. He ain't coming back. We can't use him as a merchant. <laughs> Alright. We're gonna head down here. This is gonna be a little challenging. Once we get lower, and I'm debating whether or not I want to cheese this. Or even if I would allow myself to cheese this. Boom, he's dead. These guys are nothing. Give me the item. Are you not going to give me the item? <laughs> It shows me you have an item. Give it to me. Village. Scimitar. Cool. We're gonna keep making our way, collecting as many items as I can. And yeah, this this is gonna get fairly annoying very quickly. So, those skeletons right now, they are dead. But, uh, not every skeleton in this game stays dead. So, what we're gonna have to do, and actually there should be a skeleton or two that are about to kind of just jump us in a bit. But I guess we're going to go for the Gravelord Nito first. As much as I didn't really think we'd be going for him this fast. Or if at all. Nope, oh, there you are. Can just drop. And it's dark in here. You're not that fast. Yeah. We'll just start regenning. So, it's kind of not even worth it. Just keep running. I'm going to drop down here. There's going to be a bond. Nope. That's who it is. What just happened? We're going to push this in. Why am I so slow? Oh, I think I remember why. I took off Havel's ring, didn't I? Yeah, I took off Havel's ring. Okay. Completely forgot about that. Havel's ring. There we go, now we got about a medium. We're gonna rest here, because if not, we're gonna shoot our we're gonna be shooting ourselves in the foot a lot. 
now I can do the cheese way or I can kind of walk about normally. But if we're going to go do the Gravelord Nido, we kind of need that guy to be dead. So I guess we're going to go the normal way, sadly. He died. Drop your lamp. I probably should put on humanity first. Okay. Gonna just slap him in the back. He's gone. Okay, yeah. Archer there. Not a big deal. This is just going to be a lot of Estus chugging. I'm not even going to lie. <laughs> He's dead. So these skeletons... Yeah, when you see that they drop souls, you'll know they're dead. If they don't drop souls, you kind of just want to run. Can't go through here. No. Okay. That was going the right way. Again, I think I made this very clear. This area ain't that great. Soul. Just die. And you don't have a shield. Thankfully. I think it was either last episode of the episode before that. We got this sword. It's a plus 15. Which is going to help us a lot. You kind of just want to run. Okay. Okay, yep, they're not dropping souls. Kind of want to just hurry up and do this part. Because I want to see how easily we kill the big boy. Is this not the secret? Um, yeah, I guess not. There is a secret bonfire somewhere. It's just super annoying to get to. Just kill these guys. Makes your life easier. They both jumped off. Whew, okay. And we got the Skull Lantern. Perfect. Again, this, I think this, this was the main reason. Trap ahead. Cool. I think the best way to do this is just get a... Oh, he's going to regen. Hello, a proud knight.
You want to go down here. Again, a lot of these guys just won't die. So you've always got to kill this guy. Once you do, it makes your life easier. Just watch your back. And heal up when you can. Any more coming? Cool. Now we're just going to head back up. This area honestly is kind of fun. It's not bad. It's just it can get very annoying very quickly. That's that's the best way to put it. So if you're not really prepared, I'd be very careful how you continue. And I think I did skip the secret bonfire. Nope. I'm right at it. Now, as much as I want to say rest at it, don't rest. <laughs> and I know patches should be somewhere. I'm just not entirely sure where, because I think I struggled so hard in this area in general the first time I played this game. I just complete I did the whole skip. Which honestly it's not hard. It's honestly probably one of the easier things to do in this game. <laughs> in terms of skips. Yep, they're not giving me XP, which means run. Treasure ahead. I don't remember what kind of treasure this is. Oh, I just dodged him. That was great. Skeletor! The destroyer! Oh, don't tell me he's about to get revived. Yeah, he got revived. Oh, that's how you get that. Okay, so context. That ring specifically is for Gwyn. So instead of seeing the statue of Artorius... You would see it would disappear, you would see Gwyn. And you'd be able to actually join his covenant that way. I'm gonna heal up. I think we go down? Yeah, we go down. Okay. Now, I guess we go around. Okay. What we're going to do is run. Because they're going to come back to life. Now, at the end of this hallway, there is going to be a giant... Actually, I'm going to de-aggro people. Where is it? Where is it? Is it this one? No. I want to get de-aggroed. That's the way we want to go. Is it that one? No.
He's not gonna die. That's fine. He seems to be the only one that followed us. Yep, there's a Titanite demon right there, so be careful. And just to get the... <laughs> oh my god! Yeah, this is how you de -aggro. I just don't want to deal with this right now. We'll come back to kill this guy later. I'm, I don't feel like doing him right now. Yeah, you're just gonna chill in the coffin. And wait! Yeah, the cutscene's kind of weird. And before anyone says it, it's not a shortcut. Tomb of the Giants. And here, we see <laughs> Grave Lord Nito. Though we can't kill him, we can't fight him or anything. It's just here to join his covenant if you would like to join the covenant. Sweet, right? Obviously, I'm not joining. So we're going to peace out. How they know we were alive, I'm not sure. It's just a really cool cutscene, in my opinion. But it's a good way to get aggro off of you. Okay, and we're going to run away. Don't go that way. Yep. Okay, come on. Come on, boys. Get over here. You kind of just want to run. There you go. You're going to jump down. You're going to find a big knight. We do about half the damage we need to to kill him. Nope. Nope. Come on. Get out of my face. Blood loss. And we're about to die. So, we've made it to what's going to be the most annoying part of the game. Oh, they actually don't do too much damage. Oh, yep. I just had to say something. Yeah, that, that's the annoying part. <laughs> I know I've been taking it super slow. 
But now that we've pretty much done everything, I'm just going to do skips. I'm not going through the whole level again. So if you guys have never seen anybody do the skip, it's pretty funny, honestly, in my opinion. Especially since I've already done all this. Makes it so much easier. Yeah, I've, I've genuinely made the skips easier for myself. Big boy's gone, so we're good. We're gonna heal. Oh, I got another humanity. That's funny. I would recommend using a shield if you can. Just to get past these guys, honestly. After that, you're kind of fine. But... It's time to fight the biggest joke of a boss in this game. And if I die, I'm actually going to be embarrassed. <laughs> I wonder what mask we'll get. I hope the child's. I always like the child's masks, and I think it's the one I've never gotten, surprisingly. Okay, don't die. Maybe I should have two-handed it and made sure I two-handed. Rites of Kindling. Mask of the mo is Is it the mother's mask that I always like, or is it the child? Okay, no, I think I was wrong. I think it's the mother's mask. Which this does six... What's the weight difference? Eh, I think, okay. At some point, I'm going to have to try. And, okay, I was wrong. Not the child's mask. I like the mother's mask. The mother's mask is my favorite. Now, the reason I did say that we had to go through that whole first section to begin with, even though I kind of already knew how to skip, Oh, don't tell me I had the right one. I don't understand it. Effect. No, that's dark. It's not holy. I don't know why I'm confused. Whatever. It was for the lantern. The skull lantern. Now. We can reasonably walk around. He's not aggroed on us. Though I didn't realize I took off my grass crash shield. There we go. There we go. Again, this area isn't hard as long as you kind of have the lantern, a lantern or lanterns. Because there's a couple way to get them. A couple ways to get them. Because you could use the bright bug that you get from killing the...
Yeah, you really can't see Jack. I'm at my last health. Okay. Do I have divine blessings? Okay, there's patches. Oh, I went the wrong way, didn't I? Nope, I didn't. Okay. Oh! That was great. <laughs> I got a bonfire and there's Lost Isolith. Okay, guys. Warp. Depths, Undead Parish, Stone Dragon. Okay. Hmm. You know what? I think I am going to... Kindle. Oh, wow. Well. Okay. Okay, I'm going to revert. I'm going to kindle the flame just to get 10 here. Because this might be the one that I use to go fight King Lord King Nito. So we're going to kindle it so I can get 10. All right. And I think I'm going to leave it there, guys. I hope you guys did enjoy, enjoy this video. I know we just... No, oh, I haven't uploaded. I'm sorry, just haven't had the recording space for a little bit. Kind of sucks, but trying my best out here. <laughs> but I hope you guys did enjoy the video. If you guys did, why don't you drop a like, subscribe, and if you guys have anything you guys want to say down below in the comments, go for it. <laughs> Y'all take care and have a good one. Bye.